can you just briefly explain what is whiplash and why is it significant in the automotive context? Yeah, whiplash is an injury to the neck uh, that you get typically in car accidents. And um, the majority of those uh, injuries occur at very benign uh, car accidents. It can be frontal impacts, rear impacts, uh, side impacts, uh, and uh, the chain speed change. That if we talk about the rear impact, which is, which is the collision type that is most known to generate uh, these injuries, you, you only need a speed change of 15 kilometers per hour to uh, get an injury like this. And the injury is actually, yeah, the symptoms are well documented. So there are patients coming into hospitals or to seeking medical care daily because it's a very common uh, type of accident. These low speed uh, accidents where you have very slight damage to vehicles, they are extremely common. The severe accidents that you test in crash labs, typically they, they, they are pretty rare com comparably. Uh, so th the injury is very common. And it's um, not, it, no one dies from this injury, so it's classified as a benign injury according to the so-called AIS, abbreviated injury scale. Um, and the symptoms are pain, first of all, and like headache, and, and also neurological symptoms of maybe you uh, are, um, you lose a bit of your sensitivity in your fingers, etc. You, you can have uh, disturbance to your uh, visual system, or balance system. Uh, a lot of uh, different symptoms that uh, it's not intuitive how a single injury somewhere in the neck could cause all of these uh, symptoms at the same time. And uh, the symptoms is one thing that they are uh, they are there they are uh, they uh, well established in a sense, but the the tissue, the point in the neck that is injured is still not, uh, not established. There are a number of theories about possible locations, but uh, if you look at uh, the neck in a patient with uh, any kind of X-ray or MRI or uh, PET or all sorts of uh, uh, imaging techniques, you see nothing. Mm. So uh, sometimes People that get these injuries, they, they have a hard time convincing doctors and uh, not doctor, um, insurance uh, companies, etc., that they actually have an injury. Uh, there is always the suspicion that they are just making up these systems because they're lazy, they don't want to work, they want to get paid from the insurance instead. Uh, and then uh, the, it's, it's also an extremely uh, enervating, it's, it's uh, psychologically a very tough uh, injury because you are in pain, you have uh, neck pain, headache, maybe constantly or going up and down depending on how hard you strain yourself and, and um, yeah, so so I think it's uh, a, a very tough injury and, and uh, becomes even tougher when the people around you, they, they seem to think that or they get the impression that you're completely fine and uninjured.